All right. You want to work out at home, you want to do like a, a barbell or a dumbbell curl, but you don't have a barbell or dumbbells. What do you do? Well, you can get yourself one of these suspension trainers. This is an official TRX, kind of the, the one that started them all. You can also get knockoff versions for about half the price or even less. These things are a great way of leveraging your body weight so that you can make an exercise easier or harder so that you can adjust it to your personal ability level, but you can also make it harder slowly. You can progress it and make it more and more difficult just by changing your body's angle to the floor. Um, the cool thing about these TRXs is you can mount them on the ceiling or on a wall, or if you don't want to destroy anything or put anything into your studs or your joists, there's an attachment that goes over a door. And the, the knockoff suspension trainers all have the same attachment. It doesn't attach to your door, you don't have to screw it in or anything, it doesn't ruin your door at all. It's temporary, just lay it over, close the door, hook up your suspension trainer to it, take it off and you're done. It's great if you've got a four foot by six foot space, you can have a workout at home. When you're doing exercises with the TRX, it doesn't matter which one, basically it's pretty much all the same if they're exercises when you're standing up. You want to remember to keep your core tight, like if someone was going to punch you in the stomach, you're going to steady yourself to withstand the blow. Expand your chest by pulling your shoulder blades together a little bit and look straight ahead. That is your position. Your whole body is straight. You don't want to sway or sag at any point of the movement. What we're going to do here is we're going to simulate a barbell or a dumbbell curl. When you're doing it with the TRX, you bring your arms up here and you keep your, your upper arms parallel with the ground, okay? And you're going to see why in a minute, because you're going to be pulling yourself forward towards the anchor point. If you bring your elbows into your body, then the exercise is no longer just a curl, it's becoming a row. So you have to keep your arms high and just bend around the elbows, not around the shoulder joint. Don't move the shoulder, only the elbows, okay? So here's what it looks like. I'm going to have my arms pointed straight up. My head's back, because I want my body straight, and I'm up on my heels. I want to be on my heels, I don't want to be on my toes, because if I'm on my toes, I may tend to um, hinge around my knees. I may bend my knees as I come back. I find that if I have my heels up like this, as long as it's a safe surface, if it's a slippery surface, do not do this, okay? Um, but I find if you can, if it's, if it's a sticky surface, keep your toes up like this, all right? So what you're gonna do from here is, with your elbows up, you're going to pull your hands into your forehead, and then you're gonna slowly come back, okay? Breathe in, out, keeping everything tight, your core is tight, everything's straight. All the way up to my face and back. Don't tilt your head forward in order to decrease the range of motion. You want to come all the way up. Keep those elbows high, okay? If you find it's too hard, you can't get done the number of reps you want, you just step back a little bit. The more vertical you are, the easier the movement is. The greater the angle, the harder it is, okay? So the steeper I am, the harder it gets to curl. Now also, keep in mind the steeper I get, you may want to start putting your feet flat, okay? Now it's going to be where you need more surface area and contact with the ground to stop yourself from slipping. So, that's how you do a curl, a biceps curl, with the TRX. Remember, no swaying at the lower body, okay? Keep everything tight. Lock your knees. Keep your core tight. Keep your pelvis tight. Keep everything tight here so that your whole body is coming up and going back straight. No sagging or swinging forward, okay? And no moving the shoulders. TRX biceps curl.